What's up guys? Good to see you again. It's been a while, about one week to be exact from the last video because I couldn't upload but there's a good reason for that because I am in Portugal. I'm in Viana do Castelo to be exact and this is the place where the PWA Slalom World Cup happened in the last years and all the guys always told me how amazing this spot is so I decided to come here for myself and see how it is, check the conditions and yeah now I'm here and I'm super stoked to be here, I'm super stoked to take you guys with me but to give you a little bit better of an experience of this place and a feel of this place I think there's one person missing Hey Ole! What's up man, how are you doing? Look, I'm in Portugal and the weather is amazing, do you want to come around? And there's waves you can go surf. You called me? <laughs> Sick man! Come on in! The intro was a bit cheesy, right? The intro was cheesy, <laughs> but nice to see you definitely. Yeah. Okay, well, I would say put your things down and we get a little bit of an overview of the hotel and then we get right at it. Let's do this. Sick, nice to see you man. Okay, here we are right in front of the hotel which is going to be our base for the next week and like I said a few of the PWA guys told me how amazing this place is and yeah, how amazing the conditions are here so I wanted to find out for myself and uh, I'm, I came with a lot of expectations so I'm curious I will find out this week if it can live up to my and our expectations and I have to mention that we were invited by this place but they just told us to enjoy the experience and that's what we're gonna do we're gonna find out if this is a good place to windsurf good place to stay obviously there's a lot of more stuff to do than windsurfing and today actually we were gonna look around a little bit but we're gonna start straight into the action because uh, apparently we're going on uh, on a wake wakeboarding I don't know what what did they say wakeboarding wakeboarding wake surfing wake surfing something we will see uh, we're just gonna let it come at us but this is the hotel amazing place so far well integrated into the nature and we got the bungalows with like those sticks they're built on sticks so very little footprint on nature all right guys stoked you guys tuned in and are joining us on this week and I would say let's go right are we gonna go with a boat or from the cable park? Ah, oh, so we're actually going with the boat, not with yeah, the park. Yeah, okay, sure. That's nicer. <laughs> Matteo and his girlfriend join us for some fun as well. You obviously know Matteo from the PDRA World Tour. It's fun, super fun. Well, we got the seat. It's perfect. Quick pit stop at the beach bar. Quick pit stop to fuel up and then straight on the water with windsurf gear. Jesus, it's windy, man. Wow. And flat water here. Got some waves there. Check out how windy it is. We go check the surf station, see what gear they have available and then straight on the water. Wow! All the equipment, huh? Wave, free ride, free race. And the good thing is, they got JP Nearpark gear here. 
So I didn't have to bring any gear except I brought the two slalom sails because I got the new Evos. It was super nice for me to just uh, come without anything really and then yeah, have access to this uh, amazing gear. But uh, I don't need free ride stuff. I want to go with the wave boards and then there are the slalom boards and I know some of you guys um, want to try some race boards, they even have foils here so it's good to have access to all the different kinds of gear and then yeah just pick and choose whatever you want to take. We should uh, put you out on the water sometime on the free ride gear. Do you want to go? Yeah. Yeah. I mean, they got the right gear here for you so... It looks so nice out there. Well, I think it's a shame to not go. I think it's uh, maybe a little bit too windy for you today. Yeah, but in general. In general, yeah. Because we got the... So we got the flat water over there and it's like really flat. So perfect for slalom free ride. And then you go downwind a little bit. It's, there are some waves. And I think I'm gonna go with the wave board now. Okay guys, I just wanna give you a proper overview of the spot. Right in front of the hotel you got the windsurf station and the beach bar being the center of attention for windsurfers and kitesurfers. The big harbor walls on the right side are blocking most of the waves with only some super small organized sets coming in. Other than that this place is as flat as it gets. It's looking just perfect for cruising and going fast which I'll try out later on. The closer you get to the harbor wall the smoother the water becomes but over there it seems full of kitesurfers. The next option is even further upwind inside the river mouth just one tack away. That place offers really flat water for quite a long distance but obviously much gustier wind. The further you go downwind along the bay, the more swell you'll get. Even though there's not much swell today, the wave spot is just two downward reaches away from the center and right now I'll hopefully catch some half decent waves there. She say I'm a triple, honey, welcome to Trivago. Tell me who you know, who is you tripping for a follow? But all in the air like Showtime and the Apollo. Puffing up your chest, the next thing you know is hollow, but well, hello. I've been swinging like some jello. You got one in the fun guy, he gets some portobello. So I guess I need some grease up on my elbow. Yeah. But now my light turned yellow. And I've been looking for a cheat code. Life don't come in a neat bowl. Bringing the receipt home, but we know, we know that. Your head up and your seat pull back. Ah, oh, how do people see you that can burn the man? 22, 22 years, years on the first year. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, hey, hey. I think we can give the wave spot a tick on the on the spot guide spot check. It's a nice wave spot, very similar to a good day on the Baltic Sea. And uh, small waves today, I mean it can get bigger apparently, and full power windy, so it's a lot of fun. And now time to go back. What do you guys think? Isn't this a beautiful sunset? We got a fishing boat going out behind me, which is catching the fish for the hotel. And I'm, I mean that actually, they do actually get the fish fresh from the from the fisher in town. Good morning. Good morning. After a really active first day yesterday, yeah. we went windsurfing, we went on the boat and I'm already kind of tired. So today we want to get an overview of the hotel a little bit. So we're just going to walk around, see what we can find. Yeah, it's not windy this morning, but I know it's going to be windy this afternoon. So I want to get on the slalom board later on. So there will be some windsurf action, but first, uh, yeah, kind of want to get an overview of what else there is here in this hotel. And yeah, me being the German, obviously got to put sunscreen on my nose to not get sunburned. Uh, yeah. Let's see what we can find, huh? It's gonna be a good day. Let's go. Pump track, it says. Kids go. Kids go. <laughs> That's for you, Ola. Pump track. No way. Sweet. That's nice. And like, it's merging in here. Should we try to find a skateboard? Do you, you brought one? I didn't bring one, no, but there's gotta be one somewhere here. If there's a pump track, there's gotta be a skateboard somewhere, right? Hopefully. 
Let's go and right. try to find one. Maybe I call the reception. Yeah. Check this out, man. This is um, Wojtek during the PWA here, right? During the PWA event. When was it, the PWA event? The PWA was uh, three years ago here. No, that was the first one. And then there was, uh, I think there were several events. This year obviously it didn't happen because of the uh, pandemic situation. But uh, normally they do a PWA event here every year. Slalom and freestyle, I think. Good gym, I think. Yeah, this is where, where we could stay fit if we didn't have anything else to do. I think we're quite busy. Worst case, bad weather solution. Show us something. <laughs> A lot of blood in my head now. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Good practice for the good practice for the wakeboard session. That's really nice, actually. I should get one. Is it difficult? What is it called? You want to try? I want to try. It. Feels like a ooh, squishy. Come on, go low on your knees. Oh, the taps. Seth. Seth. I might get one. This is a good board. Sophia said that um, we can get a skateboard for the pump track. Skateboard? Yeah. Okay. Sweet. Let's go. Yeah, man, I'm stoked. <laughs> May I first, Ole? It's even more fun than it looks. <laughs> Full time artist on tour, keep it real, no secret. I wanted to get home to my own Mona Lisa. What's the point of seeing CZ if you lose such a Jesus there? I pledge my allegiance. My God really do I rain. stumbled into greatness. Only logical conclusion is I fumble with the fakeness. But rumble, young man, rumble. Anything that doesn't kill you makes you stronger and more humble. If God ain't the hard west, any other. Nice. Oh. That was good. What's more difficult, skating or wakeboarding? It has a similar feeling, actually. Huh? It's, it's yeah, it's similar. But the track, the track is easy, so right? nice, and very smooth. Yeah. Super nice park. But now off to the next fun thing, which is hopefully windsurfing. <laughs> Should be some wind by now. By the way guys, Phil, Viana and I will do a giveaway so you can win a stay here, which is super cool. Big thanks to Phil, Viana for that. You can win a stay here in this hotel and do all the amazing activities that we're doing. I will put all the information you need in the video description below. So if you want to win a stay here, just check that out and good luck. So, let's eat something before we go on the next activity. Tasty. A little bit small for a windsurfer. For filmmakers, okay. <laughs> just enough. <laughs> So the sun is slowly going down? Yeah, just can't get enough. <laughs> going for another slalom session now. Kind of dead after that wave session, but I don't know. I feel like going out again and finally get back on the slalom board and go for some speed. Yeah, let's get it. If you wanna sing, we can 
So we're halfway in and yeah, we want to recap a little bit of how it's been going so far. He looks quite relaxed, I gotta say. <laughs> yeah, I mean, um, relaxed but already super tired. I mean, there's so many activities and just the windsurfing by itself is tiring me so much because I just couldn't stop. The, the vibes are just super chill. Like, it's not, it's not hectic, you know, even though you do a lot, it doesn't feel hectic, you know? I mean, it's so important to have like time off and yeah, yeah. come down. And one good thing is the food. I gotta say, the portions are not the biggest so that you do activities all the day. But the, what you get out of it, the nutrients are like really good. I talked to the guys here and they really said that was one of their main focus to get good food. So if you do a lot of activities, you really need the nutrients. The food is really, really good here. But yeah, like I said, portions could be a little bigger. And then also, I found out that this hotel has an echo label. So they are reducing trash, they're reducing their footprint. I mean, all those buildings, they're, they're built on kind of like sticks. So they don't leave a footprint behind and everything smells really like natural here. Yeah, it's really well integrated into the nature, which I think as a windsurfer is, or as a outdoor person, it gives you quite a good feeling. They don't use a lot of plastic here, actually. I haven't seen any plastic so far. <laughs> the beach is also really clean. The beach is clean, yeah, true. That's also not uh, super usual nowadays, I think. Yeah, ah, just good vibes, man. Just good vibes. But a lot more action is coming. I hope you like the action so far. Um, yeah, we had a lot of windsurfing. I think Ole did a great job filming again, so thumbs up uh, for Ole. Yeah, if you want to see what else is coming up, make sure to subscribe. We're gonna put out another video about the rest of our time here and uh, I know there's more work on the forecast. I'm already so tired, but uh, much more is coming. Um, yeah, subscribe if you want to see it. Stay tuned and thanks for watching, guys. And that is the only